What's up everybody, welcome to a new video and today we will take a quick look on CVC because once again this coin is currently pumping like crazy also, we are testing this really, really important resistance area. And if certain conditions are met, I will be definitely thinking here about opening a trading position because this coin right now is in the heavy bullish uptrend. So if you are interested about the exact trade that I'm planning to take here, of course, if certain conditions are met, then definitely watch this video till the end. But before that, I would like to ask you if you like my videos and you like my analysis. I will be really happy if you did like and subscribe button. And also if you type some comment under a video because it will simply help the algorithm to reach out my channel to a new people so yeah thank you guys for doing that and enjoy today's analysis but before that i would like to invite you to my discord trading group where i am sharing everyday crypto analysis on bitcoin and other altcoins that i'm currently watching so if you want to copy my exact trades or if you want to just follow my analysis you can join to this group and link to join is in the description or in the comments let's start today's analysis on a weekly time frame right now you can see that we took the liquidity above this important resistance area which is between level 0 0.305 and 0 0.281 so right now i will be watching what the market will do next because there are opportunities for opening both long and short trade but let's now start with the long scenario if there will be a support confirmation at least like on a, on a daily time frame then i think that there can be a pretty good opportunity to open here a long position the last take profit target or like the only take profit target that you that you can take here you need to put above this resistance area which is between level 0 0.379 and 0 0.387 you can see that this is also an important resistance on a daily time frame because here we have or also this bearish order block so in my opinion you can also place the take profit targets above this bearish order block so above the level 0 0.428 in this case, you are having here risk rewards ratio 4.47, which is in my opinion actually like not that great, but also the stop loss is around like 9%. So the stop loss is pretty safe. So yeah, this is like one of the potential trades that you can currently get here. But of course, if you want, you can speculate on just like higher take profit targets, which will give you like really, really good risk rewards ratio. But in my opinion, this will be kind of risky because historically, this is like a really, really important resistance because you can see that, for example, here it was like an important support here important support as well here important resistance so i think there is pretty high probability that the market can do simply like this so me personally i will be taking this trade even there is only like 4.3 risk reward and because we perfectly took the liquidity above this uh, resistance area there is also an opportunity to open here a short trade so if this will be just a fake out and we will confirm a resistance again under this resistance area then this can be a decent opportunity to open here a short trade stop loss you can place either above this uh, resistance area or if you want to have let's say safer stop loss you can place it above this previous high that we created during the fake out but in that case you won't have here that good risk reward ratio because my take profit targets i would place somewhere around here which will give you in case of a safer stop loss risk reward ratio around 2.07 and if you will choose let's say more risky stop loss then the risk reward ratio will be around 3.8 which is actually like not that bad so yeah if there will be a resistance confirmation then simply you need to decide if you are willing to let's say have here let's say better risk reward ratio for higher risk or worse risk reward ratio for like a lower risk let's now take a look on the lower time frames you can see that on the 12 hour chart we have here these two bearish order blocks the first bearish order block is between level 0 0.4430 and 0 0.376 and the second bearish order block is between level 0 0.632 and 0 0.57 Five. So if you are looking for some short uh, short potential position on the on the lower time frame, I think that these two areas can be actually like a good idea because if there will be a resistance confirmation, then the stop loss will be again like around 15% of the net market, which is like kind of a lot. But if you will place, let's say your last take profit target somewhere similar, like in the previous trading scenario, your risk reward ratio can be actually, for example, in this second scenario, really, really good. So 
yeah, that's like another potential, another potential short setup that you can currently get here. But uh, for example, a long position on the 12 hour chart uh, is in my opinion, actually right now, a not good idea. Because even if there will be breakout and then support confirmation, then if you will place your stop loss just under this resistance area and your lasting profit targets above this, it will give you risk reward ratio like 3.2. And if you will place under it, the risk reward ratio will be like 2.1. So right now opening a long position on the lower time frame on this coin is in my opinion not that great idea and from the four hour chart perspective we also don't have here any interesting opportunities because historically in this area we don't have here like any liquidity so for the price it's like not that big of a deal to do a bigger moves but opening a long position right now on the lower time frame again it's not making any sense because where do you put uh, where do you want to put your stop loss the first support we have in this bullish order block which will be in case of a big dump really really great opportunity to open here a long trade but in my opinion there is actually not that high probability that we are gonna test this area so simply here you don't have any important historical supports or resistances we only have this on the on the higher time frame but on these lower time frames I simply don't know where I should put my stop loss because for example putting it under like this or this low there is like really high probability of simply a liquidity grab so my position will get liquidated and uh, again the potential take profit targets we also don't have here any interesting opportunities so yeah if you want to open here some trading position me personally I would go for a higher time frame for the setups that I showed you in this video to summarize that there are definitely interesting trading opportunities on this coin but me personally the best setup that you can currently get here is that long scenario on the weekly time frame but uh, to, on the other hand to be honest I think that uh, in the crypto market there are simply right now better opportunities because you can see that for the past couple of hours this coin pumped around like 113 percent and if you will ask yourself is this currently a right time where I want to open my long position well then the answer is probably no so yeah that's why I am probably not opening here any trading position but if the conditions that I talked about in this video will be met then yeah, the opportunity here can still be great. But anyway, guys, if you want to know about all the altcoins that I'm currently watching, or if you simply want to copy my exact trades, you can join my Discord trading group where I am sharing uh, these analysis every single day. And link to join is in the description or in the comments. But yeah, this will be all from me for today. Thanks again for watching and I will see you in the next video. See ya.